concept light because our there were two main scenes where our character was well lit and another scene where he wasn't that well lit and it was all from a television so it was quite nice to experiment with different forms of lighting like studio lighting and much more high contrast lighting um, and it makes you really think about how to have, have to fill the space and how lighting is quite a complicated um, aspect that does slow the shoot down but it was nice having practice and doing it. Um, yeah the test shoot was really fun the kind of in my role as art director it's kind of a drop in the ocean what we need to do for the final final product so um, it just gave us really good idea of how important set design and props are because we kind of just work with the, the bare skeleton of what we need so it just it just like hit home how much attention to detail we need to put in and uh, obviously we need to get our resources together to make that happen and we're going to work hard to do it. What we found in the test shoot was that the background was really shadowy and so we had to put loads of light on the background and it just made everything wash out. So we trying the idea of using a green screen in the background that I can edit and to make look make it look like a proper studio setting. So you know, so there's a bit more of a contrast between what's happening in the actual um, part of the studio where it's where the chairs and the tables are and it's not like Simon being washed out into the background. So yeah, it's gonna be really interesting to edit that in the edit suite. <laughs> right, anyway, so the thing I found most challenging during the shoot was um, knowing how adjust the way I was recording sound and like my positioning in order to uh, obtain the best quality of sound. Um, because a lot of the dialogue of the script um, goes from very quiet to um, quite loud. So um, yeah, it was quite interesting to figure out how all that worked and um, I think me and Tammy who does camera developed a quite a good relationship of um, discussing uh, how to record sound and how where I need to be positioning and I think we both got a better idea of how that works. So it was good, it was fun. Woo! Hopefully we'll be um, getting a track which will be completely original and um, I think we really want to, the aim is to tap into a lot of different types of sounds to create a lot of different emotions and atmospheres. So yeah, really looking forward to it, to create, um, to create what Barbara would call. <laughs> to create the world that we, wanna, that we want to create. <laughs> to create the hyper-real reality which yeah. we are trying to embody in the script and hopefully with Barbara. Okay, just you cut it when I go. Um, I got to talk a lot with Darren Stoneham, who we picked for Simon, and I think he fits the role perfectly, and that's really good. He's going to be uh, really important for the development of the project, and we got to test out some of the shots that we storyboarded that we thought weren't going to work, and they ended up working. Uh, track shot, an accelerated sequence, did loads of experiments with lighting. It was just really amazing to see um, stuff that we'd been working on on the script uh, for so long, to see it on screen and to actually do it and see that it works and that. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah, well, to be fair, it was quite easy to produce a test shoot, which was, I mean, it was amazing how stress free the test shoot was. And I kind of take it as as achievement because obviously the shoot can be really stressful and I loved that it was stress free even though we had the fire alarm throughout the shoot which basically stopped our shooting for like one hour we, we were all relaxed and because we we planned so hard for this test shoot so we were prepared for basically everything even even for stuff we couldn't prepare for uh, yeah my real job starts now basically uh, we have so many things to plan for and we've got two months left so that's what I'm looking for. Uh, well, the test shoot was uh, was was invaluable, really, because uh, it makes you realise exactly what you're going to do. So you know, for example, the handheld shots, you know, you have to use a, a grip and stuff like that, or we're going to use all these things like micro dollies. Um, we're going to have tracks and stuff uh, to get really special effects. Um, yeah.
yeah, the test went really well and the actor was really responsive and it was all, it was all really good, really. Um, good practice. Come to life. Oh, it was really helpful script-wise. Um, Darren and I actually talked about the script at length. Uh, we lengthened some scenes, we uh, changed the dialogue around a little bit. Um, and it's been really good for script development. I think um, from an assist assistant director point of view, the whole crew is working really well as a unit. Um, we were only one hour behind schedule, and considering we had a fire alarm, I thought that was pretty amazing. Um, so I think the general atmosphere is really positive, and we hope that you guys will give us more money so we can make this happen.